So today I heard a new cold call opener that made me lean forward. So here it is. My phone rings. I pick it up and the salesperson said this. Hey, Josh, this is Pete with Acme. Uh, we've never spoken, but we're working with several sales podcasters and I came across your name. Do you got a sec? Here's why I lean forward. The salesperson said we've never spoken before. That lowers resistance because it answers the first question I have whenever I get a call from a person that I don't know, which is, do I know you? So we proactively addresses that and lowers resistance. And then he's providing context, a reason why Pete is calling me instead of someone else. He's saying, we're working with several sales podcasters. He's subconsciously saying we're somewhat connected through a common denominator, in this case, sales podcasters. And then he's piquing my curiosity. What do these sales podcasters have to do with me? And then he says, do you got a sec? It feels very chill and relaxed, which makes him seem more relatable. And because he's asking me for permission to talk, and if I give it to him, I'm more inclined to hear him out. He's giving me control rather than taking control away and assuming that it's a good time for me to talk. When you take control away from people, you raise resistance. Nobody likes being controlled. When you give people the ability to decide if they want to have a conversation with you, you lower resistance. You give them autonomy or agency. Here's how to make it even better. Uh, he might say something like this. Hey, Josh, this is Pete with Acme. We've never spoken, but we're working with Will Barron over at the Salesman Podcast, and I came across your name. Uh, do you have a brief moment? Notice there, he's being more specific. He's actually mentioning a podcaster that I would probably know about. So what do you think about this opener? Do you think you might be able to modify it for your audience? If so, give it a try and let me know how it works out for you.